friends what's up this is RK from 360 reader right now I'm going to show how you can add legacy contacts on your iPhone iPad and Mac Apple has introduced a praiseworthy feature called Apple digital legacy that is designed to secure your digital legacy after you are gone you can take advantage of this feature to pass down your information to a trusted person like your friend or loved one after you are gone let me show you how to add a legacy contact to your iCloud account on your iPhone, iPad and Mac. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. It's worth pointing out that your trusted contact will access certain information from your iCloud account including messages, photos, notes, contacts, calendar events, apps you have purchased, your device backup, etc. Do know that your trusted contact won't be able to access your iCloud keychain or any licensed media. Based on your needs, you can manage your legacy contacts, keep track of your access key and even revoke access to the key by removing a person from your trusted contacts list. First off, I'm going to show how to add legacy contacts on iPhone and iPad. To get it done, launch the settings app on your device and then tap on your profile photo. After that, select password and security. Next, you need to scroll down and then choose legacy contact and then tap on the add legacy contact button. Now, tap on add legacy contact again and then enter your Apple ID credentials and sign in to your iCloud account. Next, select a preferred contact and tap on continue. Finally, iOS will generate an access key which you can share with your trusted contact. After you are gone, your trusted contact will have to provide a copy of your death certificate and the access key to gain access to your data. It's worth stating that you can manage your legacy contacts right from this setting. So if you ever want to remove a contact or add a new one, simply come back here and then do the needful. Now I'm going to show how to add a legacy contact on your Mac. It's just as straightforward on the macOS device as well. Simply open the system preferences and then click on the Apple ID. After that, go to password and security section and then click on the edit option located right next to legacy contact. Now, go ahead and add the trusted contacts. The process is quite similar so you won't face any issues. Do know that you can add multiple legacy contacts to your iCloud account. That's all there is to it. So that's the way you can add legacy contacts on iOS, iPad OS and macOS. Now that you know how digital legacy works, make the most of it to keep your digital legacy forever alive. If you have found this information helpful, make sure to like and share this video and I'll see you in the next video with more such helpful tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have an amazing time. Bye-bye.